Hi, I'm Akila Joy Connolly, and you're watching and reading Rising Talent Magazine. I started loving musical theater and was about six years old after seeing my first Broadway show, Mary Poppins. For some reason, the Broadway stage, or just any stage, just scared me, and I don't know why. But then I really wanted to know what was behind the scenes of being in a show. So I started a community theater with my friend, and she tricked me into thinking that an audition was really just a game. I auditioned for it, not thinking it really was an audition, and I got the role of Molly and Annie. Then after that, at about nine years old, I got my first manager. My favorite part about performing is definitely the thrill of being on that stage. There's something about it that just, I can't describe. Being on tour was definitely an amazing experience. I got to perform in so many spectacular theaters and I met so many great people. I loved the city, Dallas, because my best friend surprised me there. And then Arkansas, because they had some of the best food. I recommend flying burrito. My favorite scene in my Christmas has to be the very end of the show when we all sang White Christmas, when I got to run out to the stage and yell at snowing and watch the snow fall onto the stage. My favorite song has to be Sisters because my best friend and I in the show got matching costumes and we got the fans and we sang it and performed it for everyone. It was really amazing. I would have to say the city that stood out to me the most was San Antonio, Texas. There was something called the River Walk, which was a boat that went through the river of San Antonio and brought you to different places. It brought you to different restaurants, stores, and it was all lit up for Christmas. It was so pretty. I auditioned for Harry Potter and the Cursed Child three times in about a year and a half. The third time that I went, I actually had a family emergency, so I wasn't able to attend it with the girls. But then they asked me to come with the boys. That was a funny experience. But then three months later, I was offered the job. Okay, so I was longboarding outside and my friend ran inside very suspiciously. So I followed her and inside was a big brown box. And when I opened it up, a bunch of balloons flew out and they were black and gold. And there's a bunch of envelopes attached to them. And each envelope had a picture of me when I was little, just loving Broadway and being on stage. The fifth envelope held a picture of Harry Potter and the Cursed Child. And on the back of the envelope, it said, guess who the next Lily Potter is? Some qualities that I feel are similar to Lily is that she's silly, like me. She's curious, like me. She loves her family, like me. And she's very imaginative. I definitely cannot say too much because we all know, keep the secrets. But I gotta say, the whole show is so mysterious and so exciting. I just love it so much, but my favorite part of the whole show is definitely the beginning of part two. One of the shows that I absolutely loved doing was Mamma Mia, and I got to play Sophie. And right now in school, I'm actually learning Spanish. So I think it'd be great if I did Mamma Mia in Spain, and I did it in Spanish. This is very hard to choose, so I'm gonna say two. I think it'd be Anya and Anastasia, or Regina George and Mean Girls. The first professional theater show that I saw was Mary Poppins on Broadway. I'm gonna say two because I can't decide. I'm gonna say Anastasia and Mean Girls. Now, I know they're both two totally different stories, but I just love them so much. Okay, 
The reason why I love Anastasia so much is because it's just so emotional and just touching. And I love Mean Girls because it's just so sassy and it's fun. And I love the music. My advice would be to just focus on your training, learn all the aspects of musical theater, to understand the part and just love what you're doing.